The director of CID had sent his findings to the director of public prosecutions, Kariako Tobiko, following a probe into the claims made in February by the Coalition for Reforms and Democracy that the head of civil service, Francis Kimemia, the PS internal security, Mutea Iringo, the chief of general staff, General Julius Karangi, and the director general of the National Intelligence Service, Michael Gishangi, were linked to a pre-election rigging plan that would have used the provincial administration, among other government agencies, in favor of the jubilee presidential candidate, Uhuru Kenyatta. Kimemia had been accused of organizing meetings of the provincial administration aimed at securing support for Kenyatta. The other officials are alleged to have participated in other meetings with the aim of ensuring that Kenyatta ascended to the presidency. Kimemia, through the government spokesman Mudui Karyuki, had in the recent past dismissed the allegations. But Obiko says that after carefully analyzing the evidence contained in the submitted CID duplicate inquiry, he was in agreement with the CID director that, quote, there is neither direct nor circumstantial evidence supporting the allegations, unquote. Tobiko says that the allegations were also the subject of a parallel inquiry by the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission. Tobiko has now ended the CID probe, concluding his statement by saying, quote, In the premises, I accept your recommendation to have the inquiry filed closed with no further police action, unquote. The Office of the Director of Public Prosecutions has now returned the duplicate inquiry filed to the CID director, meaning the matter will not be pursued any further. At the Osman, Citizen Live at 9.